It's Saturday, and you know what time that is? It is time for the Saturday show, keeping you of the, in the know of things that are happening next week. Yes, the Grind Show. There's all of these things next week that are happening. Sort of. It's a. It's actually a very dry week, but we'll talk about that, why it is. So if you're new to the show, I'll explain what's happening in a moment, but basically we just go over what, what's happening next week over the various different days, preparing you stuff for Alliance Quest, Alliance Wars, incursions, you name it, that's what we do. Make sure to like button, subscribe, all that stuff. Yes, very, very evil. And as all you know, the show wouldn't be possible without the amazing work done by Dan of Frontline MCC, creates the MCC calendar. Make sure to check out Frontline MCC, links are always in the description. Dan is my co-host of the Contest Run podcast, and he is amazing, an amazing site that has everything you want from guides from crystal tracking right right the way through to information about what's going on in the community make sure to follow dan especially on twitter where he has well he's approaching hopefully we can get up to 4000 uh, 4, followers as soon as possible uh, but yeah all that information including stuff going on Go and check out Dan. Also, on a bit of a personal note, if you're looking for a good 30 minutes of time to kill, then I really would recommend going and checking out this interview with Toby Maguire, Tom Holland, and Andrew Garfield about Spider-Man No Way Home. It's great. I'll put a link into it in the description down below, but it's it's a lovely watch, and uh, I think it's a great behind the scenes for anybody that's a big Spider-Man fan, and as well as a fan as well. I am with the Spider-Man No Way Home. Now, we kick off as I usually do with, well, what's, uh, what's happening at the weekend? Sad on on Saturday there is there's not much happening we go for a very stale and dry period of the game especially as we're kind of waiting for things like uh, well the uh, lunar event which will be dropping so yeah uh, on Saturday and I would say use this time wisely if there's content that you want to get done that you've been putting off for a little while and it's great to see people of the community going back into bits of content I mean for me I'm doing Act 7.2 but I am grinding lower content in order to pick up stuff like revives and health potions to prepare for my grind in Act 7.2.6 before then focusing on Act 7.3 which hopefully I'm going to be doing in uh, the following week so uh, stay tuned for that and follow some live streams when I'm going to be doing that as well to chill out with me. Now on Sunday there's going to be a tier 4 basic arena for those that are interested. That's the only thing going on on Sunday. Use this time wisely. I know Command Mount putting out loads of stuff but use this time to the best of your ability to kind of get grinding with uh, with other things. Monday is the last day of January, January 31st. On January 31st there is quite a bit going on but it's only for those that are largely interested in that. The first thing to say is that there's going to be a top zone refresh so all those lovely shards will be refreshed as well as milestones they're going to be refreshed as well so if you like gold you like your shards you like all that stuff then go and uh, grind out a little bit of incursions. There's also the black iso market reset for the ones that have the uh, the, the summoner sigil. Um, I'm not currently spending on summoner sigil. I'll explain why in another video. And also there's other stuff going on like alliance quest begins again as soon as it starts, as soon as it ends, as soon as it starts once again. And also one of the big things that'll be happening on Monday is the announcement of Quicksilver as the winner of the Summoner's Choice 2022. Uh, I mean, the balanced and fair uh, summoner show, sum, Summoner's Choice that, um, you know, it, it could be one or the other. Yeah, it could be one or the other. Look, let's face it, it's going to be Quicksilver. We all, we all know it's going to be, going to be uh, Quicksilver is going to win that, but things could be a bit spicy. I doubt it, though, but things could be a bit spicy but they probably won't. The final massive thing coming out on Monday is that we're going to be seeing a special Lunar event. Yes, the Lunar New Year event. Drops on the 31st, and that's uh, surprising, really, because a lot on the date information that I have, it, it looks like that this event would drop on uh, Tuesday, the 1st of Feb. So I kind of find that a little bit weird, but... Um, it, you know, it, it is what it is. I, I can't really complain. If it drops on a Monday, it drops on a Monday. There's going to be a special mini quest, which hopefully gives a lot of... Uh, I think before we've seen stuff like little sneaky things that are quite nice. And pockets. If you're not familiar with pockets and also the... Um, uh, tickets you send tickets to people and you get pockets and the pockets you open they're kind of like crystals and you can get some nice stuff from them the particular lunar new year best new year stuff that you can get is uh, listed on screen right now we've done a full video on this yesterday so uh, make sure to go and check out that video uh, from various different things crystal shards force to hero crystal shards. it's not it's like an auto fighter thing it's not meant to be difficult if people are complaining it's not oh, this is not difficult and it's not spicy rewards 
it's never been like that over seven years. So if you're ex uh, expecting it to be difficult, it ain't going to be like that. There is a mini gifting event, but it is case like you, there's no spending with it, which is which is nice. And also there's uh, other things as well that you get from this, you know, free mythic crystals, volumes of eight, the crystal drop rates uh, of stuff. I'm not quite sure how they're going to be improved. Will they be improved? Probably not. But um, yeah, some nice free stuff. And also there is a little calendar, which uh, the calendar for those that are interested looks a little bit like this. This is one from previous years. So it could be a case that this is buffed in any kind of way but i think we're all looking forward to something a little bit fun and it's nice to kind of like uh, end off uh, january and go into february with a little bit of like uh, woohoo good stuff so of all that stuff now tuesday uh, that's the thing you can there's, there's there's nothing going on on tuesday all that kind of like big start to the week and then we go into a bit of a lull especially because we still have to wait another week Another week! Yeah, February 9th is when new content drops, uh, so there's nothing on Tuesday. And on Wednesday, same thing, there's no further week of Strikers, so it's just, um... Class Catalyst... Clash Arena thing, so... Yay! Stuff to do! Fun times! On Thursday, one of my favourite Spider-Men enter into the basic arena. We'll be doing predictions for this champion when it comes to Thursday... No, Wednesday, the Wednesday edition of the show next week. But uh, yeah, it's good to see uh, this entering to the basic. A really great champion if anybody wants to pick pick it up. Definitely my rank three. Um, debatable first rank four, but I think I'm going to be going with Doctor Doom in any case just for a prestige bump. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. You do you at the end of the day, who you're ranking up and all that stuff. And on Friday, it's going to be nothing. Uh, as I said, like, it's kind of important to... Uh, and there may be like, more information about spotlights and new champions and stuff like that. At the point of recording this video, I don't know any information about what the new champions are going to be. N nor do I know about the spotlights. I just have side event information once we're recording this on a... Uh, was this Thursday? So, yeah, um, that's... Yeah, there could be more information next week about new stuff coming for February. It's been a very long month, and that's just the thing to point out is uh, use this opportunity. And I would like to say like this, you know, this again like last week, oh, we'll do grind tip of the week. What is the best grind tip? And that's the, that's the thing. I'm not going to re-repeat myself a lot of the time because that just seems to be the, the thing. So I'm going to just say my tip of the week is to get some content done that you may have been putting off. For me, it's been a great opportunity to push some content aside and focus on some other stuff. And I probably will be not doing a Cavalier difficulty 100%ing it next month, so the month of February, to focus on things like 100%ing 7.2 and 7.3 before the release of 7.4. I don't know at the point of recording this video, 7.4 is going to be in for the month of February. And I certainly don't know if that's going to be in for the month of March. Either case with this, it's just like, look, if there's content you've been putting off or a challenge you've been putting off, then use this opportunity whilst it's been a bit stale to get all the monthly stuff done and dusted to then have like one week solidly pushing on stuff that you want to do. So yeah, it's all about having targets, having goals, having things that you need to do in game and going and smashing it. So that's kind of like my top grind tip for the week. And that has been, uh, yeah, the uh, the grind show for Saturday. Lots of stuff to look forward to at the start of next week. And then after that, it goes a bit stale. Uh, but it is what it is. It normally happens with uh, MCOC, except for that arcade thing last year, which was, uh, that was a thing, wasn't it? That was a thing. So uh, I'm happy for the um, better time allocation to do stuff that I want to do. Appreciate you all. Check out some other content located on screen right now. Hope you enjoyed the little crystal opening with M as well. That was a lot of fun. And I'll see you in the next video whenever that will be. Bye-bye for now.